South Australia to be here over the next nine days doing everything that's great about the Royal Adelaide Show. So, uh, in order to kick things off, I'll introduce uh, Superintendent Danny to have a few words on behalf of uh, SAFER. Good morning, everyone, and thank you for the opportunity uh, to be here and uh, thank you to, to Will and his team here at the uh, Royal Adelaide Show. strong police presence uh, out in force that we do every single year and as you can see behind me uh, very pleased to have the ongoing support of South Australian Police Mountain Operation assisted by our bicycle control. We will also as you can expect have a strong presence of traffic police out there to enforce the 25 kilometre hour speed restriction zones and we have the assistance of other members of the South Australian Police. Inside the show grounds this year like we do in every other year we will have uniform police presence and we'll also have uh, police working in plain clothes and that's just to ensure the ongoing safety and protection of everyone that comes to the show to make this a fantastic annual family event. Any questions? Uh, there was talk of extra security measures with the terror threat level being raised. What will we be doing to keep people safe? Yeah, police are not doing anything different this year than we normally would. We have a very strong police overlay and we continue that this year. So you're comfortable with what you do already? That's right, we're very comfortable with our police presence this year. And one thing I must mention too in relation to children, uh, we do see a number of lost children in the show. Unfortunately we had over 50 people uh, last year that had become temporarily displaced from their families. As extra measures this year we will be asking that the families come in and take photographs of their children. We can actually assist police and we can share that live uh, through the police systems. But very important for parents too to actually put your children in high visible easy uh, for police and other people to actually uh, identify the children re of the parents. When you say register them with police, is there an app or anything? Uh, so we have safety wristbands, uh, like we do here, they're available at the show kiosk. Very strongly encouraged that you issue your children those and again, just another identifying feature to help reunite loved ones with their children. Are there any other major concerns for this year's show? No, from a police perspective, no major concerns. So look, we, we go on the uh, amount of police we put in the show every year and uh, like we do, we consider that the police numbers are actually acceptable, our response is acceptable and for that reason we're not making any changes this year because there's no reason to suggest that we need to and I'm very satisfied with the police response we've been putting into the show again this year. Can you just reinforce the security measures that do take place? So obviously people, security goes through people's bags, that sort of stuff? Yeah, certainly. So that's a uh, security um, response here uh, by the people in Of, uh, of being at risk, but when we are, we take positive action. I'm led to believe that appropriate and a positive action is taken in relation to the incidents that occurred last night. Great. Thank you. Okay. Thanks, John. Thank you. Um, this is uh, the, the society has been putting on the Royal Adelaide Show for 185 years now, so security is something that we look at every year. This year will be no different. We look forward to welcoming everyone here, having a safe and very happy event. Uh, your entry ticket gets you access to more than 100 free things to do here at the show. Some really exciting features that I know will be shared with everyone a bit later today. Uh, we've got
got Gluttony here managing one of our main stages. That comes with an entry price of your ticket. During the midweek, we've got Bluey come again. She's a, she's a phenomenon Bluey. We get extraordinary crowds in the goiter for that. We've got a new and bigger Taste SA attraction, all the new rides, a second Ferris wheel, which is disabled friendly. seeing everyone here. Will, can you just reiterate some of the security Said we, we expect about one in three South Australians come, and it takes a while to uh, reconcile those figures. The show.com.au is the best place to get your tickets or any one of 91 food that across the state. So, you're making any changes with the forecast? You know, we're expecting some windy weather. Will that impact the fireworks run through or rides or anything? Oh, they're, they're always things we take into account on a daily basis. Um, we have to show flexibility. Um, we've been doing it for a long time and we'll continue to do it. as our security personnel and all the agencies can find that person and reunite them. We've got a really great track record of reuniting people for Really pleasingly, we've been able to hold ticket prices flat for children, only up 50, percent, uh, 50 cents sorry, for concession holders and a dollar for adults. And once you get in, you can get here at 9 o'clock in the morning, leave at 9 o'clock at night, more than 100 free things to do. You can bring your own food and drink. Of course, everyone loves to have a treat as well. We think we've got the balance right. Uh, it's a great value event for South Australia. And how well are ticket sales? Yeah, ticket sales are really good, but people can go online and, and we know that uh, they tend to buy as they're rocking up to the gate. So uh, we're really comfortable where they sit. show.com.au and you literally can plan a full day of activities and it presents great value for money. You get free entertainment on three or four different stages, everything from gluttony, midweek children's entertainment, fireworks at night, V8, all the free entertainment. So there's plenty to do, it's fantastic. 
Thanks, everyone. Have a great week.